access to water remains a challenge affecting many communities, especially rural areas. To address the challenges, stakeholders have convened at the Water Supply and Sanitation Forum in Lusaka. And the mandate for these commercial utilities was in increased. Even the mandate of Kumasuka that we should regulate also rural water supply. So should the utilities also go into rural areas and actually supply water to villages. I can imagine the challenge there. Urban per urban is reasonably straightforward. In his speech, Water Development Minister Collins Nzovu highlighted the need for comprehensive coordination from all stakeholders in the sector. This forum comes at a critical time as we prepare for the coming pre cholera season, especially in the context of the ongoing drought. The reduced supply hours of both water and electricity present additional challenges, but we cannot allow these obstacles to compromise public health. I therefore expect all commercial utilities to develop a cholera mitigation plan by, 20, by 30th October 2024. It's worthy to note that lack of collaboration and coordination among sector players has had a very negative outcome. Key among them is a duplication or duplicity of efforts as each of the players will be focused on their own agenda and objective. Meanwhile, the German government has pledged to support Zambia in the fight against the water crisis. You, we are trying to render support to, to, for example, such a conference like here where everybody is, is getting together. And this is only the first kind of, it's the kickoff of now kind of ongoing discussions uh, where everybody's, all stakeholders come together. Later, a communique was signed and released by the two ministers to jointly constitute a task force to analyze and evaluate water challenges in rural communities. Alice Lubasi, ZNBC News, Lusaka.